Good afternoon, everyone. Today's Sunday, and Sundays are the best day to do your, let's say, stock research and homework. And what I'm going to talk about today is a fascinating company called Trade Desk, which from the lows of 2020 has been up 440%. That's what we do. We look for these stocks both on a technical and a fundamental um, standpoint in order to go forward and to give us some buying opportunities. So we look at the fundamental story. Trade Desk is it's a platform for ad buying that you can go to their website and just read about it because you want to feel comfortable about the companies that you're buying. You don't want to just buy a biotech and really not understand it. You really want to deal in your core competency of what the company does. So that's one of the first things that I do. The next thing is I jump over to Investor Business Daily, which is fantastic. And what I do is I run the stock um, checkup. And there's, um, how you call it, an extension that can actually rank the stocks even for us even easier. And I learned through this through one of the meetup groups for uh, Can Slim. And this stock, again, if you look at it, has zero flaws. And then you also look at the a combination of the ROE and the PTM, return on equity. And the idea is you want it to be over 40%. Because what we're trying to do is identify the strongest fundamental stocks. So I definitely suggest you jump on Investor Business Daily and subscribe. And you do a homework. And you can see this. Look at it right here. It's the, the top stock in that sector. It has a composite rating of 99. Markets in an uptrend. And then the other thing, too, with the industry groups, you look to buy with, as long as it's within the top 40, which is 29. The group ranking is an A. Earnings per shares, if it's better than 96% of all the other shares. The last earnings per share change was up 69%. The last three quarters, 50%. You can see when these dots are green and yellow and red. And you'll notice that everything is green. That's why it's perfect. Actually, here, this one's yellow. Okay. Bottom line is, this is a very strong fundamental stock. And again, what I first wanted to say was, from this point, here, which was in the, let's say, the bottom of, in, in the March, in the midst of the COVID crash, you're at one, whatever, 140, 160, 170, and we had a big run up to here, to 972. We pulled back. What we try to do is we try to identify entries upon pullbacks, which is right here, cup and handle. This is the whole idea. You had an entry here. An entry here, you had add on buys, add on buys. Here you might have gotten out, taken out, taken your profits because it was a big move here. Got back in. Earnings. And the other thing I want to be everyone to be cautious of, and this is the whole point of what we're doing is education to make you a better trader, make you a better investor. You're not looking to day trade, you're looking to find the strongest stocks in the strongest sectors when the market is healthy. And we just showed that the market is healthy. It's in an uptrend. This stock, CDD, had a nice pullback. The question will be, can we have a buy point? Ideally, the buy point is the high here. We're going to have earnings coming in, and you want to be a little bit careful right before earnings. So this is a stock that is setting up. This is a stock that had 440% return. Mind-boggling. And the idea is to jump on board, get ready for it, and learn. Look at this last earnings where it jumped up. You don't buy the first thing. You could, but then you have this, you know, you don't feel that comfortable. Let it open. See what happens. To me, my buy point right now is taking out the highs here. And we're going to watch it. So it's on my watch list. And that's what we do on Sundays. We build our watch lists.